It is quite surprising that the two species are not related to each other because the external and physical similarities of two animals one from the cat family and one from the dog family are quite convincing of course we can say that cats are superior to all predatory species but this dog defies that theory although they are very not agile their strength is extraordinary lion versus tibetan master Who will win in a real fight? Let's see this. Aggressiveness Tibetan Mastiffs are strong-willed, determined, protective and intelligent. They are overprotective of their families and can be dangerous if not properly trained. The Tibetan Mastiff, both one of the oldest breeds in the world and one of the strongest, was used to guard homes in the Himalayan region. For the most part, feral dogs can compare it with the brute strength of lions, but there have been a handful of occasions where they have had victories over feline rivals. Such cases are rare with an injured or sick lion, or a long cat caught by a large herd. <laughs> Except you cannot defeat a hunting master animal like a lion. It would be like a woman dreaming of beating Ken Black. We remember him here with love and respect. There is no need to talk much about the lion, as you know the lion is the lion. Hunting skills. My favorite feature in lions is that they hunt together. Lions hunt either alone or in packs. In mass hunts, the lioness is usually the one who initiates the kill. Lions chase after their prey and when they get close enough they attempt a brief attack on their prey, either trying to attack their target or take it down. Mastiffs, on the other hand, have historically been guard dogs that guard homes and property. But throughout history, they have been used for blood sports such as hunting dogs, war dogs and fighting each other and other animals including bulls, bears and even lions. But they are not born hunters. That's the main thing. Size doesn't matter much in this matter, even if the lion is a weak lion. He has repeatedly experienced from the word attack. Fight Force The Tibetan Mastiff and others have a formidable presence as they have some serious jaw strength. For this reason, it is important not to tease the dog and keep it in the presence of strangers until it is fully trained. Tibet is known for its powerful bite with a bite force of 550 psi. It is the second strongest bite force of any dog breed. At first glance, a lion bite, measured upwards at 650 psi, may seem extremely powerful. An average adult bite with approximately 150 psi, which makes exactly 4 times. I want to share my favorite analogy with you again.
while lions eat bones. It is like children eating candy. Intelligence Comparing Tibetan Mastiffs to other easily trainable breeds does not do them justice as they are extremely independent and highly intelligent dogs. They are also known to show dominance over other dogs that they are not familiar with but tend to get along with over time. However, they are also quite stubborn and generally do not respond to traditional obedience training. They don't care about learning the same thing more than once. The Tibetan Mastiff is not a breed for new dog owners or pet parents with a lack of confidence. Scientists have estimated that dogs have roughly the same intelligence as raccoons and lions, while domestic cats have intelligence comparable to bears. So they have more or less the same intelligence. Perhaps Tibetan Mastiffs might be enough for other dogs, but certainly not enough for lions. Muscularity Maybe he can fight an elephant, but he can defeat animals such as bear and deer. Their bodies are built to develop muscular strength and endurance so they can attack and kill large animals. These big cats can take down elephants, buffaloes and even giraffes. Fighting an elephant is really tiring and even impossible for humans. More tiring than even the most grueling wrestling training. Imagine trying to knock down an elephant. Lions are much stronger than regular big cats. Watchful aloof, imposing and intimidating. The ancient Tibetan Mastiff is the guardian dog supreme. These densely coded giants are mellow and calm around the house, swiftly devoted to family and aloof and territorial with strangers. Despite its large size and large hair, it's a very athletic dot. See you in another video. Thanks for watching. I am Pit Dog.